as its food in harvest. How long will you lie there, you sluggard? When will you get up from your sleep? A little sleep, a little slumber, a little holding of the hands to rest. And poverty will come to you like a thief and scarcity like an armed man. I'd like to repeat verse six. Go to the end, you sluggard. Consider its ways and be wise. Amen. the set men of this ministry together with his wife uh, uh, Pastor D the fivefold ministers who are here the executive members of the church the elders of the church the advisors everyone in the mighty name of Jesus Christ Amen let's just clap hands for Jesus Christ the presence of the Holy Spirit in our midst this morning even as we are going to share the word of the living God in Jesus mighty name as uh, that is Amma's daughter was reading the scriptures you already know where it is uh, let us let us say the mission statement of the church we want to go we as rock of salvation And raise them as faithful stewards. Naka Muruti Matlaku. Ayakamotas Hamo Postola. Tebuho Joseph Mlaut. Bahaecho, we may be seated because the word has already been read unto us. Iriki Rapele, Mudimo Riale Boha, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you for the opportunity that we could gather together as brethren to come and hear your living word, the word that changes our lives, the word that brings knowledge in our lives, wisdom, the word that orders our lives right. This morning, that you still love us with an everlasting love and your righteousness draws us unto salvation. My Lord, my God, Rapela, Ribuledi Tebeta Moa, Ruto Hormobi Tepo, Uri Moma Plonga Rona. May you open up our eyes, my Lord, that we could see in the name of Jesus. We vow to give you the glory. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. I hope I'll not be long. Uh, this morning, we will be speaking on the topic, hindrances to a victorious life in Christ. As we know that our theme is living a victorious life in Christ. We would like to welcome the visitors if they came a little bit late. 
Let's start. Um, let's look at the background of the book of Proverbs. The book of Proverbs is one of the books of, of, of wisdom. We have the book of Proverbs. We have the book of Ecclesiastes. And we have the other one, the third one. Right. The book of Proverbs has its theme being wisdom. The Bible says that Jesus Christ is the wisdom of God personified. Now, when uh, this man called Solomon, the son to David, King David, penned down these proverbs, he was inspired by the spirit of God. We sometimes think that the proverbs that he has given us come from his head. But he was inspired by the spirit of God to write down the proverbs. Not all proverbs are captured in the Bible, which were coined by King Solomon. Amen. Number two, the overall purpose of this book is to provide all of us, young, middle-aged, old, with knowledge, skill, discipline, and understanding essential for living a successful life before God. Every one of us need, needs to have a vision about Pulusoyakar. We need to have success as part of our desire in Christ. No child will always be a child. But a child will move from being a baby to a toddler, a toddler, uh, a young person, up to adulthood, up to maturity. So in other words, all of us need to come to a place of maturity in our belief system. Through the wise sayings, people will receive instruction in discipline and righteous living. We know that we are coming from different backgrounds. We were not, we were not taught the same way. Now, we need to be disciplined in that area. We need to be disciplined in, in that area. So, we are here, we have come to school. We have come to the school of the Holy Spirit, the school of God. Because God has a plan with my life, with your life. God wants to see his children growing and becoming matured in Christ. As the nation of Israel grew, so did the need for administrative leadership in the kingdom. Now, even here at church, the church is growing. We are going to grow exponentially so. Yet, there is a need for administrative uh, work in our church. Leadership is needed. So, everyone must make sure that I'm going to learn. I'm going to learn ways of administration. Amen. Solomon is the author of this book and did so in the years 900, between the years 970 and 931 before Christ. This book covers almost every aspect of life. You, you talk about uh, raising up a child. This book talks about it. You talk about raising up a boy. This book talks about it. It, it will always say, my son, my son, take heed. My son, listen, do this. Don't go to the house of uh, that woman. Amen. Amen, Bazalwan. Bommel Santata. Praise the Lord. This book emphasizes three things. One, submission to the principle of cause and effect. The principle of cause and effect says that if you do this, that will be the result. You know, I, I always remember my father when, when, when I was, uh, uh, when I started working, I got out to weep. You think, 
Yes. Then my father would tell me, Can I not pull it? I was here. 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 Pampula, Akebatsu, Nakamoto, young Bat, Naki, Nuela Bujala, Homunati, Caraba, Homunati Ratsaha, Retaxa Labutahar, Yano Habu or Dobla Kebatu, and Obuaya. But little did I have the understanding, Yaur, Uaiit, Hurudira Halamobu Pelo. Amen. So it talks about the cause and effect. So when you Teach, teach your child. The Bible says that raise up a child in the way that he should go. When he is old, he will not depart from it. Proverbs chapter 22 verse 6. And umu train alula And umu And umu train alula bete Alula bete Boy, did you make up your bed? Go and make up your bed. Warata harate utsanete alule bete Yes, because this will catch up with him in future. This will catch up with her in future. Especially Satana. Train up your child in the way that she should go. She will not depart from it when she has she, she's old or when she's grown up, when she's matured. Oh yes, practicality. With like the book of Proverbs. Amen. So we see that our relationships are affected because we could not do the basic thing. Rona rele batadi hara kudisa ba nakatsila emu dimuari betingyone. Now we have to receive this child at a back home. Kabakala Hore. Mwanao Haruti. She was not trained. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Uh, the first one I talked about the law of cause and effect. All all ideas, choices, and behaviors have results. The result is coming. The Bible says that the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal life through Christ Jesus our Lord. So there is hope in Christ. There is hope in Christ. There is not discipline. Yet in the house of God, you'll find all of that. And God has given us gifts in the persons of the pastor, the shepherd. Jeremiah chapter 3 verse 15. He has given us shepherds according to his heart who will feed us with knowledge and understanding. Among the brethren. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Our choices chart the course of our lives. So we kopelang so ne konia no. Se toko affect in the future. Se toko tsara kopele. Now we need to take wise counsel from the pulpit. Mutanga wa modimo ure rale ntula modimo every Sunday. Kiwa we kudi se konia no. He'll be taking a sabbatical for some time for a few weeks. Baruti batarera. Yaka ikurite jana. However, it doesn't matter kuru kure rama. When, when God speaks to you, listen and respond accordingly. God will want us to account for the word that we have heard. Mubu pilomba runa babu kreste. 
It's not a matter ya go takerekeng o bo bo wa o ya gae. Kerek to haste to nothing is happening. I gonna change. There is a big problem. So we need to take ownership of what we sow. Because this is the law of sowing and reaping. It's sowing. We will reap in future. Cast your bread upon the waters and you will find it after many days. Our God is the God of the truth. He says, I am the Lord and I change not. He says, if you are faithless, I remain being faithful because I cannot deny myself. That's who I am. Hallelujah. Submission to the existence of external authorities. Right, we have authorities like parent to parent child relationship. We have a teacher pupil relationship or lecturer student relationship. We have skin subject relationship and we have pastor and member relationship. Hallelujah. Now let's look at a few uh, words that we need to, to explain from the title of our message. Our message again, it's hindrances to a victorious life in Christ Jesus. We, we are not only concerned about going to heaven. We are not only concerned about seeing the angels being in the presence of the saints, wearing white, while we are still here, we need to live the life right here. So this is a practical book, a book of wisdom. You know, I, I always say to my, to, to my, to my children, you know what? Dianite. Yet they came up with these wise sayings, the proverbs. Why? They, they looked at life and they were able to make a conclusion about how things happen in life. And then they came up with proverbs. For example, but but use bone to elaborate. Then how you na kwa baba? Kuru uska katwa kibunze ba mosadi. Umu lebelete fela uso rinyanyala kianyala ki. Oh nyala, how muit? How muit? Ule bato. Muto kaiti we se nah. Sto na sariyalo. Amen. Praise the Lord. No, I'm just joking. Where are we now? Right. Now, let's go to Proverbs chapter 6 verse 6 where God uses a little thing and he compares it to a human being. Moto. Ubapanya moto. Little swan. You. My God. Uta uri. Uri. Go to the ends you sluggard. Consider her ways and be wise. You were not wise before you were sent to go and see the, the ends. You know, we would look at these ends. They have a formation. They have a formation. No, there is order. Our God is the God of order and not a God of confusion. Amen. 
Now, we would look at them. They they cut straw. Bedi tsela straw. Utabona engwe lengwe ina le sengwenyana mo molomong. Di loba ko khuting ya tsone. Ha di fetsa di a bo wa gape. Di lotsa. Di a di a ipela ka go nna kwa mari ga yetla mo ileng gore. Ha go pa tla ba khona go tswela ko ntle tla bo go le marurutata. Na mudimu ar libella tsoswana ithute go tswa mo tsoswane. Bona gore wena o mokalo ba o motona o mokana. Tsoswana ke sonyana se se nyenyane. Yet we can learn for from a very minute organism. Very minute. Go ka ka na tsoswana tse kae mo nambo. Oh my lord. Millions upon millions. Yet God says go and learn from it. Yo. Yo my sister when it yo. Lena ke tsogile ke le ya. Ya tsosa ka. Are go to the end you sluggard. A sluggard is a couch potato. Motho tla mo fitla la dutse mo dutse. One way o dutse tshe. How for the whole day. Ha ile mari ga o tla malele tsatsi. Le be le mo swabise le wela. a couch potato he's slothful o botswa o botswa le go tla spoon a a tsenye moto go ka moganong o botswa ba tswa fa a re ke a tswa fa but you see hana ke simola ke buile ka batsadi ka bana ba yana ka ntla gore batsadi ga ba ruta ba Yes we did not enforce discipline are ben are ben practical basalwa hara enforcer discipline mo baning ba rona baby le iri bana ba how if you can take a rod and hit this child ha no swa ke 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 rona ba ntse re phela ha no swa baby le iri instead you will re- You, you you will remove or you'll take away his soul from hell book of proverbs e tshujwa ha se tupa fela le wise words from you as a mom o bua le ngwana gago o mo bontsa tsela o mo bolela gore ngwana ke kana ke tswa mo staging so le mo so Now, can I take you back a sluggard Barcelona kid? A sluggard ke motho botswa, a sluggard is slothful. Hana hana tsela e right. It's a sluggard. Are verse 7. Which having no captain, overseer or ruler. Rona Ronaldo Bosco Merco. CEO mang 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 supervisor and everyone else me for us to work there must be somebody who's guiding us but the end doesn't have any captain yet it does the work meticulously so yes the end is diligent it works hard during times of need but na ke ke krile employment some people do are not employed you are a christian u pulusitswe but at work when u busy u bua mo phone ba to buy a make you mole no service from you why should the company keep you why why we are not supposed to be kept in that employment hari employee we ka ba ka la hore pulusitswe no because of the correct work ethics Yes. Yes. Why should we be a problem in the planet that God made for us when we were supposed to become problem solvers? Repulusitswe so so that we must give wise counsel to the people of the world. Ribabontsetsela. Yet komereko we become very lazy. We take our own time. Hallelujah.
Praise the Lord. Now, Kitarisha, the definitions. The word hindrance or hindrances is the state of being interfered with, held back, or slowed down. Slowing down of progress. So, when I was in the boss, instead, why it's Because the next thing, and that will be a problem. Synonyms of hindrance, blockage, impediment, something so that stops you, obstruction. And then we have the word victorious. It talks about having won a victory, moral harmony, or a sense of fulfillment. You know how we need something, or when you have accomplished a certain task, you become satisfied that I have done my work properly. You have accomplished something. The overcoming of an enemy or antagonist. How to say diabolos? Thank you very much. I couldn't be where I am today. Ma ban niki banka nya sejana kase saruna sejano kuna lidi dilo dilo anatene lohori my technician una dite. So now it happened or while he was still busy he showed me something so i found the dealer then this guy this guy said no harnatona kibegire okay hadio kotropong e ka ba go ntshekelo hadio kotropong ar ha kotropong hadio ar di ko rent back now kanana oh from mohaiki rent back it's a problem because in a city it towards one o'clock. It's a yaku. We understand that traveling time, it would be a problem. So I undertook taxi in one of uh, the the shop. Then I walked to the the, the, the other one. So, oh, because all the had Yet now, bona kimo kiti kreile kotropo. And if it is sinte, kulu ita mas sinte yano. Kimo kono kufita mo kereke kabakala mang kabakala mure na modimo. So that is victory. I'm victorious. The Bible says that we are more than conquerors in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Oh, yes. Morena Jesu kiena ulu ili ntua. Kiena oza ni moring. Alwa, alwa, alwa. Bam mita, bam utuisa butuku atwa dinto. Atulu hamadi. Kale bakala, kale wena. Bible ibe ita iri. We are more than conquerors. Rifita batudi. Jesu utuzi. Batsifuka sitewa kiruna. We have the cup of victory. Hurumurana jesu rituleit. Hallelujah. How do we hope to live successfully in Christ Jesus if we are lazy? The Bible says that we must consider the ways of the end. We have talked about that. We should compare our brain with the brain of the end. We have talked about that. Now, ants are diligent. They are hard working compared to most of us. We need to be concerned with the quality of work we do and the quality of work we produce. You know, it's, it, 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 it's so good. It's so good to me. It's so good to me because I'm going to break. 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 Yes. And I'm going to break. I'm going to break. Now, I'm going to break. I was so humbled. One day, a certain children came to me. I'm going to break. I'm going to break. I'm going to break. But I ran a teacher, a Kirgi teacher, teacher Matakura Lebuch. Yes, go high school. They always ask us, Rutilikima subject A. 
re re ba bolela hore ke thetse re a matlhako be ke ba bolela hore no bana ke litse hore ke chain ntho e ha se matlhako fela matlhako una feleletsa se se simolotsweng ke bo tshabalala ke bo nteo le bo mang le bo mang le bo mang so nna ne ke ba brusha fela wa ba ke ba brusha hore ba khone go ya ko high school but otherwise the children are grateful or we have laid a good foundation yes so to me it's a reward and ke ba bolella gore wa itse keng wana ka ke batla gore tsa tseleleng ha ha o setse o le doctor because nna ke ba bitsa bo doctor re ukwa pele gore ke ba ba kharietse ba di followang tlo ba eng wena o doctor wena o eng wena o eng ke doctor ke tlotla go setsereng ya o setse ke go dile ngwana ka o tlo mpopona ba re ba popona re ba itsa o be a silomo a ba re hema 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 au wa tse re dirwa di tlaela mo tate boroko eish a ke ba rutegile parema o hem o a ke ntse ke hema ya no ke hema ka mofute o ma hema hema hey okay are in leon ba salwane proverb chapter 20 verse 13 iri do not love sleep lest you come into poverty open your eyes and you will be satisfied with bread yes baba ngo ba rona re iketla you know but bate o malume o khona o zothenga o kudla o bani bani o khona mang mang o teng ha muruti mulaotsi o teng o tla mpha tshelete ke lore ka bupi but how long shall we be dependent on other people we must wake up bible le tshotswa ha se nna khotso ba ratua ha se nna ke bible i real i re open your eyes in other words o ske wa nna o re mereko ga o mo afrika borwa o bona le batho mo strateng ma khonu wa dibiri no you need to wake up o bona o rapela o botse modimo re what can i do in order to bring a change in my life and in my family ki what is it no i wake up sleep fela sa go robala botsigo no but ba bamba robetsi ba ntse ba botsi mahlo ba tsama ba robetsi fast asleep bo o se ba temo kere ke mo ha ba ba boni mar ba batla go nyala fast asleep fast asleep bo re ba teng ba tla ba ba tle bo re ba ba rona ba ba batla ba ko strateng ba ko strateng ba ka go tsenya mo mathateng Okay. I read the next scripture. Proverbs chapter 12 verse 27. Ir, the lazy man does not roast what he took in hunting, but diligence is man's precious possession. Kwena o wa tswa o lo go tsoma. O lo go tsoma di pologolo. Why 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 bola pologolo o tla le yona bo ikenya ka mo storo. Ba se manyana ba botsa. Ya no papa, re lo go bua le ha no smang mang o do etla. The worker wait o tla tsai bua. Ning ning ibodile itswa di boko. Why because you were lazy. Yes. When over to go bereke lo ke batho ba ba. The next scripture Proverbs chapter 20 verse 4. The lazy man will not plow in winter. He will beg during harvest and have nothing. Ki bui la ke? He will beg. It's not right for us to beg. David says that I have been young but now I'm old I have never seen the righteous forsaken neither his seed begging for bread How le mzalwana bana ba gagwe ba tsona go tshora ke tlala No 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 you are misrepresenting the kingdom of God and of Christ you are misrepresenting it go ra gore wena ha o batle go rutwa wena ha o batle go nka wise counsel We are being taught every time yet you don't want to apply the word of God in your life. Amen Basalwa. Amen. Kai kai ko pa amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Are to Leon. Proverbs 26 verse 14. As a door turns on its hinges, so does the lazy man on his bed. Go rwa fetho. Agora vai bana hinge ya munya. Ir. Ir. 
Wafet au sheba ku east. Bulao ki bulao ki bomo. Sheba ku east. Aten a sheba ku west. Ke meriko wa go. Ha to ga mmelo bo tlhoko. Yes, how when you oversleep mmelo na bo tlhoko. Kle bo ga modimo for that. Hanga benisi seo bana ba tla robala 24 hours upon 24 hours. Okay, we have looked at the first one in uh, the, the, the cause and effect. Akiri, hari rutaba na reba blela kati functions. Hore, there is an input, there is a process, and an output. Sao se jala, humpienu, will go through the process. And then, wena haunto, haunto yemeti result unto itang, unto rori samorena, unto lebo hamorena. Omrena ke a leboga gore o mpodisitse dingaka di paletse ke bolwetse bo mme wena ga gona se pese se go pallang o makhona tsotlhe o fetsa kenkere o fodisa bolwetse bo di epilepsy wa di fodisa e morena ke a leboga the time will come when you'll receive cause and effect sowing and reaping what do you sow in other people's lives is also important. Rito sheba mulomo. Milomo ya rona ya rikisa hore batho ba ntseng ja. You rather be a person of few words. Za no ne motho bo ang thata. Ha ntso bo ya thata ya lo utsenya pepere, utsenya letswai, utsenya eng eng na ke ditsa ke ra ke hape ko ga ya ke hape. Na ke tse go apa hela bo that's where I specialize. I was not trained in that area. Praise the Lord. Okay. Uh, good mouth versus bad mouth. Good mouth versus bad mouth. Muruti wila buwa about James chapter 3, rahu pula bazalwa. Nagiri, hore, lulimi. Lili li nya niya, nakamu karakale khanu la motu. Yet, it can set the whole forest on fire. Muti, ukasi nye, hakaba kala lulimi. Ditong. Hirti den, ditong. Haribu atata, Bible is in the multitude of words. Sin is not absent. In the multitude of words, sin is not absent. In the process. Tanto rapel or mudal and pemata kilo kupa me chwaran. Mpemata kilo bankanya di kantame. Proverbs chapter six, verse sixteen. Proverbs chapter six, verse sixteen. Iri verse 16, these six things the Lord hates, yes, seven are an abomination to him. A proud look, a lying tongue, hands that shed innocent blood. Verse 18, a heart that devises wicked plans, feet that are swift in running to evil, a false witness who speaks lies. And one who sows discord among brethren. Now, I'll be concentrating on the tongue. The first one who work a lying tongue. And why repeat that lower down there about a lying tongue? And then Ababu a false witness. You know, there are people who are brave enough to go to court to go and lie about somebody. Just because Utoile Batubako next door. 
Therefore, I have the right to keep pushing the the Bible is vengeance belongs to God. How We need to be humble. We don't need to be proud. Pride is behind all of these actions. It's because of pride. It's because you don't want God to solve the matter. No, I'll solve it for myself. You are alone. You'll solve it yourself. And then, and one who sows discord among brethren. Muto tobo kanyang bahatu. Mure na jeso ruku kwante mu. Hore we should come and worship God. In spirit and in truth. Really free. Hope munati. We should enjoy the presence of God. Yet bat eng bahatu. Baba yitang hore batu batu bohane. Kore mure na jeso wa build. Wena wa destroy akamu. Karakia mudimu ya hula akamu. Wena wa isinya. The third one, the third one, pride versus humility, pride versus humility, pride give we kohomoso. Pride irikin nakin na kona omu unkap. Come on, Zama unkap le gamodim because ur I am and there is no other God beside me. Yimi yimi. Hucha sakalo tomu. Kin na possible. Eh, laun to le mozadi. You don't have to tell your child that. Humeza awe hori you are in control. No, why, why? Why, why, why? Hum, stakusa ha. Umana isenga di stakusa ha. The child is there to be taught again a knowledge from the parents. Not to be scolded like that. Sometimes we become a barking. We we are abuse our own children. Come in low moyarona. Why it is so See stronger than how come obey. Because le fuko haleboi hobua monoana. So it's a willing. See, le see, le see, fiti le. Mo pelongi angwana. You can say where na kadi tebe se tswana zanta tau. Gatsho ko ye khol. What is all that? Your very own child. You can't talk like that to your child. Retwante re tuta neng ba kaechu. Whether kingwana kimu to middle age or uchodile ra tuta na rote up and down. All right. Now, pride was spotted first in the archangel called Lucifer. The the name Lucifer means light holder. The Bible tells us that Lucifer would walk on top of fiery stones in heaven. Lucifer was created with musical instruments in his body. When Lucifer sang, you could hear the trumpet. When Lucifer sang, you could hear the violin. When Lucifer sang, you could hear musical instruments in him. Jesus, we give you the praise. Oh my God.
Lucifer having all those qualities the Bible says that he was full of wisdom in the day he was created yet iniquity was found in him he 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 began to have pride in his life the Bible says that he was cast out of heaven he lost his position Lucifer but kaba kala bi kukumu so we lari utla arise aya khudimu ko khudimu ma khudimu ko khudimu are i will be like the the most high god kur ka mantswa mang modimo mo bopileng utla motlosa go dule yana mo sennong sa bogosi but shame followed that action o kai today muruto tlare he's a hobo spirit yes he has lost this position. Modimo ba bo parona. Ya no wa bona hari worship modimo so u tla bo tlhoko ga go wa kwazeka. Kwazeka Lucifer. We worship God in spirit and in truth. Yes, a kwazeka. Ha be le di pain mo mmileng wa gagwe because now we are the ones who worship God. Proverbs chapter 11 verse 2 Oh Jesus help us It, When pride comes then comes shame but with the humble is wisdom Proverbs 16 verse 18 Pride goes before destruction and the haughty spirit before a fall Then we come to Esther Riaqala Queen Esther That's the name of the book but then King Ahasuerus of Persia, the present day Iran. He had married a woman called Vashti. And Vashti, the Bible says that she was beautiful to behold. She was beautiful to behold. Movement vocab. Movement vocab. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> no movement vocabulary. <laughs> Hallelujah. Now, Bible in reverse, King Ahasuerus, we lie at a molito. A festival. And that feast festival lasted for 180 days. He was an overseer over, I think, 120 provinces from India to Ethiopia. Now, on that particular period, or during that particular period, one way, he was with his princes, with his governors, with everyone else. Bible iri and then aba aita party engwe ya batho botle ya 7 days aba re ablela di university mo hore a ke limpiletseng vashti a ka tlo parade mo ke bone bontle ba gagwe ye 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 wa ukwa inkisa ka inkisa ko mo rena jeso o batla go go ba re wa ikhwantsa ka rona ya ka ilabuwa ar did you see my servant job there is no one like my servant Job in all the earth. Ana modimo a u aka bua mantswa ya lo ka nna le wena na. It is my desire modimo a bua ya lo ka nna le nna. Arla mona ba simane morawaka. Le o tsantsa a bua arla mona moradiwaka. Ke ipela ka yene. Because you have been tested and you've been found to be faithful. Bible be faithful in little in order to be faithful in much. You are faithful with your life, Mokereke. You are faithful with your life, Komereko. You are faithful with your life everywhere. Kostrate. Now we have to drive the campio botamo kuloing borekia kita ho boxer. Kita ho bonta. I'll give you a little of, your, of my mind. The little that you have. 
Utasala kai. A bit of my mind. Utasala kai. Bible here, go to the ends. Thou sluggard. Consider her ways and be wise. Caliph. Now, the Bible says that Queen Vashti refused. Abitwa ki khos. Ahan, arhakiko, murelni rhakitiko. I'm fine here with other ladies. I don't have to be parading my beauty all over. Bomme, barba nyeti. Ripe la kabo. saka <laughs> Re tswantse ri ipile ka bone vice versa le bomme ba ipile ka rona bomme ha re ba tshotse sentle ko mmere ko ba bua ka rona ya tsa bua ka pace ise o bua ka nna ko mmere ko ya my husband yeah it's a good thing because hamza di abu ka hore she has a husband o bla lor she has a head on top of herself her head because the bible says the head of woman is man the head of man is Christ and the head of Christ is God. Who oh, refollow the line of authority that God has established. Then Bible ya rebelela basalwane. Eskikwala. Eh. Ya rebelela Bible hor. Then one prince will abua are. Eh, the what she has done is deplorable in the whole country. And sasieta o seta a bad example ko bo me baba nanu khosi ya babu to rete ya nya no akhuliso ar according to the law of the Medes and the Persians rete ya ba tla le molao ba re ha khuliso ante a tlotswe mo ke mong ya gagwe go tsene o mong o kaone go na le yena one better than her ya nanu Pride can make us to fall. Yes, sometimes hari pona re liko go dimo dimo. O CEO ya kan ya company. But then pride it loe tsang go ruetse ya o e go fight. Then you lose that job then somebody else comes and replaces you. Vashti was ultimately replaced by Esther. Bible yare blela gore batho ba bane ba prepare iwa ba tlatswiwa for the whole year a prepare for le nyalo think of it ke ne ke bua ka yona ka re go radio today ke re kana kone re gola bane ba bua ka gore ba tlatswiwa ka ka mashi bo mme ba a ke tsore ne le nnete na but bane ba prepare lo le nyalo e ba zalwane we thank god for this time that we have heard about the hindrances the things that make us not to be successful in our lives as Christians. Let's close our eyes to pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, thank you for the grace to be able to speak your word. Lord, we thank you that whatever that needed to be spoken today was spoken and more will be spoken by other pastors, my Lord, at other times in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we vow to give you the glory. The glory belongs to you. In the name of Jesus. If you are here, you are visiting this church of ours and you'd like your life to be made right with God. You'd like to have discipline in your life. You'd like to have knowledge and understanding and wisdom in your life. You want to get things right in your family, in your community. Jesus is the one who makes our lives right. We are fathers, we are mothers, we are children who understand ourselves because of the contribution of Jesus Christ in our lives. Hai be o leteng o bata morena Jesu a go pholose that he must change things mo pholomba ga. You could lift up your hand and we'll pray with you. Hai be o leteng maybe you are visiting. Hai be o leteng 
Do we have anyone? We don't have anyone. We don't have anyone. I don't see anyone. Do we have? Oh, we have somebody. You may stand up, mama. You may stand up on your feet. Likaya makama oto. You may take your stuff, your bags, and come to the front. Maybe you are wrestling with this, this matter of getting your life right with God. No, but to us. If you are here, Jesus is the answer for the world today. Above him there's no other. Jesus sees the way. Jesus. Jesus is the answer. For the world today, for the world today, above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the way. Um, Mama, is we like an kulunkulu liti? Uma umuntu akolwa ngenti ziyo. Uguti unkulunkulu wafusa ujeso eba fi eba fini eba fileyo e ukuluma ngomlomo wakhe intindiso yakhe indlela sisindiswa ngayo leyo ngoba ujeso uye wafa esiphambanweni afela mina nawe ukuthi sibe abantwana baka unkulunkulu manje ke ngizoxela ukuthi mama usho lomthandazo lo after me nane okay Masiti baba nkulunkulu ngizakuwe ngegama laka Jesu Kristu ngiyavuma ngenhliziyo ya ukuthi uthumele ujeso ukuthi azosifela esiphambanweni ngiyakhuluma ngomlomo wami ukuthi ujeso winkosi nomsindisi wempilo ya Bali kamalam, enwatiniyako, yempilo, nyabonga baba, ngetuba leli, ugutinam sanje, impilo.